I'm going to show you how to make an image slider that looks a little something like this. Or this. Or this. All right, let's get to it. I'm going to set this up on my sample site. So the first thing we're going to do is log in. And we need two plugins for this. The first one is NextGen Gallery. NextGen. And this is what's going to manage our pictures and everything like that. So we're just going to press install now. And click activate. The second plugin we need is the actual image gallery. So it's a plugin for the NextGen plugin. So it's called JJ NextGen jQuery slider. And click install now. And activate it. Now what we need to do is upload our pictures. So we're going to go to Manage Gallery. Sorry, we're going to go to Add Gallery. And we're going to create something called New. So that basically just makes a folder called New. So we're going to upload all of our images into the new folder. And we'll select them all. You can select them all by click, clicking the first one and then holding shift and clicking the last one. And you, you're going to want to make sure all your images are the same width and height or it's going to look really funny in the gallery. In the image slider, I mean. Click upload images. Once we do that, we're going to want to go back to the plugins and go to the visit the plugin site because we need to copy a little code for this uh, next gen jQuery slider. And we scroll down and we can see this is the one we want, the second one. So just copy that, I'll explain it later. And let's make a new page. And we'll just paste that code in. So this right here is the title of your gallery. Gallery 1 means it's your first gallery in the next gen gallery. Uh, HTML ID you don't need to worry about. The width of your image, I know that's 960. You can figure that out if you're on a Mac by right clicking or control clicking, I mean command clicking, and pressing get um, info. On a PC, you can right click and go to properties, I think, and it'll tell you the width and height of the picture. So, height I know is 400 pixels. And the way we figure out that this is gallery one is we can click right here and insert our gallery and we can see that the ID equals one and that's where that number comes from. So just put the corresponding number in there. Once we do that, we can click publish. and then view the page and we can see that the gallery is there. I accidentally have sidebars on here so I'm going to edit the page, take off the sidebars, update it, and view the page. Now it's way too big for it but that is how you make it and if you made it the proper width, which I didn't, you'd see this arrow on this other side too. 
But that's basically how you make a, a slideshow. And uh, if you want to message me and show me yours, that'd be great.